The Comptroller General Nigerian Customs Service, Bashir Adeni, says the uncertainties and anxiety towards 2023 elections and suspension of excise on single-use plastics, carbonated drinks, telecommunications VAT affected customs revenue. He stated this at an interactive session with the House of Representatives Committee on Customs and Excise on the review of the service 2023 budget performance and its 2024 proposed budget. C.G. Adeni noted that the cumulative effects of 2023 being an election year, cash crunch, narrow redesign and other factors led to the drastic reduction on customs revenue. The customs boss added that the revenue projection was 3.669 trillion naira, but the service collected 3.202 trillion naira from January to December 2023, which shows a negative variance below target due to the factors listed. And G, the service is looking forward to the area era of cargo tracking in collaboration with relevant government agencies, particularly the Nigeria <coughs> Shippers Council for effective monitoring cargo vessel movement to avoid diversion. And H, this is a uh, process that is already ongoing, is the congestion of the nation's seaports. It is planned to ensure that we have efficient and effective port operation, which at the end would guarantee more revenue. We must also add that our anti smuggling campaign, using all required operational guides as provided within the confines of our laws, will be intensified in 2024. This would be to ensure that illicit trade that creates spares for revenue leakages as well as economic sabotage are reduced to the barest minimum. Responding, Chairman of the Committee, Honorable Leke Abedidi, said. Over the four budget cycle, the committee has witnessed the emphasis placed on e-customs for trade facilitation and other economic contributions of the process. According to him, the impact of e-customs cannot be overemphasized, adding that its understanding will make a more technologically advanced customs. He noted that budget framework must align with the main objective of a reformed customs that will go with time and deliver its mandate. Today, as we stand on the cause of progress, the committee seeks insight from you, the Contra General of Customs, on the tangible impact <coughs> this modernization endeavor has brought to the Nigeria Customs Service. We are eager to learn about the impact of this e customs modernization, the number of scanners deployed and functional and the integration of artificial intelligence in our border stations. Understanding this facet is vital for assessing the efficacy of our collective efforts in steering custom and exercise operations towards a more efficient and technologically advanced future. At this juncture, the committee will it to spread its gratitude Honorable Abedjide said the committee will intensify its oversight function to ensure adherence to the set objectives and laws. Aniti Patrick, Co. TV News, Abuja.